Hello everybody, I am Linkzilla, and welcome back to Ratchet and Clank. Well, when we last left off, we basically cleared out everything that we could do on this planet, but I figured that we could go around collecting a few bit more bolts before we head on to the next one, and maybe load up this launcher cannon thing that we got. Right, I think that's plenty of bolts, at least everything that we can just scrounge in the immediate area. Still can't believe that, that coward ran away. I honestly thought that we were going to have to fight him. Well, I might as well. Hi there, Fuzzball. The Glove of Doom. I love the power glove. It's so bad. Oh. Certainly took a hefty chunk out of my finances, but... I have my own little family now. Come, my children. Let us cause havoc across the galaxy. Alright, kids, hop in. Make sure you got the si make sure you got the booster seats. Right, let's head to that Blarg station and see what kind of trouble we can get into. There are two gold bolts. Oh no, I'm leaving my children behind! I'm a terrible father! Oh well, can't be helped. It's natural, it's up to natural selection now. I find it weird that we're just able to land here. Another one. I got some great bargains for you today. Taunter. Hmm. So I guess this will go to enemies into attacking. This looks like an escape pod. 
This shuttle has an autopilot, which will take you to a decommissioned Blarg warship. Scanners indicate there may be useful technology on board. I think we'll leave that for right now. I have filled up my quick ch choice wheel. I need help with enemies. Seriously. Damn it, Ratchet. Yes, I know that I'm controlling you, but come on, boy.
Look at this guy, standing at attention, not giving me any respect. Okay, I've got terrible aim. I'm starting to think that this is the path. This is the way. So maybe I should go back to that last room, huh? what I get for trying to be smart. I'm so smart, I'm dumb. The hiding monsters in boxes now? How embarrassing. Yeah, I'm still using the trespasser. I wonder if I can hit the swing shot from here. I can't see a goddamn thing in this room. Seriously? All the way back to the beginning? Man, I really like these old classic games, but 
This game has a serious lack of checkpoints.
Hi there, fuzzball. Hmm, let's see. Oh, that's a nice one. Oh, that's a nice one. Is it is it really? That was fairly easy. the blast not take that thing out.
I really had no idea that that was going to work, but I'm glad that it did. And this is where we fight the giant one, I presume. Yep.
Okay, so... That was actually an enemy that did put up a bit of a challenge. Mainly because these controls are a bit more awkward than I remember them being back when I was a kid. Seriously, circle button being shoot is not intuitive. Speaking of not intuitive, literally both trigger buttons, R1, L1, R2, R3, L2, they literally do the same thing. Like, friggin', this is L1, this is L2, this is R1, this is R2. You could have had R2 be, be crouch and have firing be, you know what, I really do wonder. There's no option to change the controls. Why is it that so few games actually did that back in the day? I thought I was a goner this time. Some nano-wit in genetics must have left the cages open again. You could come down now. Honestly, a gadget engineer deserves a bit more respect, if you ask me. So, you are an inventor. Gadget engineer. I create revolutionary devices for Executive Chairman Drek. For instance, the Ola. My soon-to-be-patented grind boots. Look, I, I, I need to get out of here so I can find a new job. How about I sell you these? At cost. Sell? After we just saved your scrawny butt? All right, all right. I'll give you the employee discount, too. 2,000 bolts, huh? Well, thanks. I'm gonna get out of here while I still can. Why isn't this door opening? I have a very bad feeling about this. Oh well, let's grind. Oh yeah, we're in space. There's no, <laughs> there's no oxygen to suck. Oh, I missed the bolt. All right, we're back here, and 
pretty sure that this opens the way to Larg Warship, I think. Send Clank out to explore outside the station. Okay, little buddy. Looks like Clank can fight. What the? He's heavier and not nearly as agile as Ratchet. It's gonna be a bit of a problem. There we go. <gasps> Lisa has a checkpoint. Yeah, I don't know much about anything when it comes to physics, so would a helicopter would helicopter blades work in outer space? Like, these are the things that can only work in an atmosphere, right? Also, how is Clank even falling, I, I wonder? Gold bolt. Am I cool now? Dang it, these look like things that you could basically grab onto and climb up.
This is probably the way that I'm supposed to go. So I don't want to go there anymore. Yep. Put me right back here. All the way back here. I supposed to get that gold bolt. How the heck do I get up there? I feel like in order to make that jump, I'd need Ratchet. Is Clank's antenna supposed to be red? I thought it was green. Got my own little family. Uh oh. Commence search and destroy. That up, boys. You don't blow yourselves up like those useless guys from the Glove of Doom, do ya? My little friends, looks like this is where we part ways. How is Clank lifting that? How did he compress that into his... <laughs> he knows. He knows that I was going to question it. <laughs> 
That little giggle, that little impish giggle basically says, I know that you don't know how this works, and you never will, and that brings me joy. <laughs> Well, I guess it's time to return to Ratchet. Maybe we can come back out here when we have some kind of space helmet for him. I'm back. So you are. And I found this. Hey, cool. It's a, uh, uh, what is it? A hydro displacer. Great. I always wanted one of those, I guess. Yeah, but what does it do? Right. I guess now we go destroy the warship. really hate these things. Sick em, boys!
Big red shiny button? Hmm, what's it do? Thank you for selecting our automated self-destruct feature. Vessel annihilation sequence initiated. Please remove all personal belongings. Can I help can't help but feel like I did them a favor considering that this place is overrun with these monsters. Perhaps you didn't hear me. This vessel will self-destruct. Boom. In a matter of seconds. Please. Wait, I didn't get the info bot. I guess he got on board. Special report. This is Darla Gratch reporting live from Blackwater City. We've just learned that Captain Quark will be presenting the grand prize at the Intergalactic Hoverboard Championship, which will be held here over the next few days. In related news, this planet has recently been suffering from an infestation of strange amoeboid creatures. The city's administration has assured this reporter that every step has been taken to eradicate these nuisances. Darla Gratch, Channel 2 News. Career women. Did you see that? Yes, I hope that poor woman is all right. Ah, uh, she's fine, I think. I was talking about the hoverboard races. Well, I think that's about all the damage that I can do around this place. Because I'm pretty sure that I can't actually get that gold bolt without Ratchet. So. Anyways, I'm going to cut this episode here. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you liked it. I mean, I'll catch you guys in the next video. Later.